we're going to be watching a new series. It's called Yuri on Ice. And the only thing I know about it is that it's a sports anime. It's about figure skating. And that apparently, I've been told, uh, this is a very fitting show uh, for replacing Sasaki in Miyano. So I'm very, <laughs> I'm very excited to find out what exactly that means. Over the years, he has never ceased to surprise me. Oh. From the first time I saw him skate until now. Whoa. It's been one surprise after another. I'm guessing that's going to be our main character that we're going to be following and his journey to becoming the best. Sure enough, he's crushed the free skating event as well. This oh. marks the fifth consecutive Grand Prix final win for Russian legend Viktor Nikiforov. Russian. Okay. That was the guy that we saw in the very beginning, right? That uh, inspired our main character. My name is Yuri Kotsky. At 23, <laughs> okay. I'm one of the dime a dozen figure skaters certified by the JSF. 23. I had high hopes, but I came Very in close last in my first Grand Prix final. I'm still having a hard time accepting that. Before the match, the pressure got to me and I started binge eating. And then the family dog died. I was a complete wreck. I mean that it's cool that he's already a pretty well-established uh, figure skater. We're not going to see like his journey from beginning to end, but it looks like things are not going well for him right now. Yeah, I figured you'd seen it on TV. What? You had a viewing party? You gotta be kidding, Mom. I'm gonna <laughs> die. <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. I messed up. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> the Junior Grand Prix Final Gold Medalist. Oh, he Yuri looks Plisetsky. angry. Hey. I'll be competing in the senior division next year. Maybe it's time for you to retire. Oh, this is gonna be great. This dub is gonna be fantastic. It's been five years since my last visit to Asetsu. This old station even has elevated tracks now. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> Welcome home after five long years! That's really that? not necessary. Dance straight and smile, would ya? Is that his mom? Why am I surprised? I should have figured Minako would know my exact arrival time. No. Hey! A friend, isn't maybe? That Yuri, the ice skater? I mean, I'm glad people are recognizing him and are proud of him. At least a little bit. I can't bring myself to say this out loud, but here's how the last year's gone for me. Okay. The figure skating competition season generally starts in the fall, but I lost big in the comprehensive Grand Prix finals early on. Ah. I couldn't shake off the failure and lost again in the nationals. I see. I didn't make it into the four continents or the world championships, so the season's over for me. So we're going to be following him on his journey to get better for the next season? There you are, Minako. Thank you for going to get him at the station. Yuri, welcome home. Yeah, thanks, Mom. That's his mom. Okay. It's been a long time. You know, you look like you lost weight. What? You're so sweet to that old lady. <laughs> what about you? No matter how much you drink, you don't seem to gain a pound. As for you, what kind of gut are you hiding underneath that bulky coat of yours? What kind of relationship do they have? Is it a All childhood right, friend? Or a coach? Oh my god. I was born and raised here in Hasetsu Kyushu, a castle town by the sea. Castle The town. castle isn't so much a castle as a facade with a ninja house inside. Oh. You'll be skating last. Well, Hana, so what do you think we can 27. expect from tonight? Okay. If anyone can clench this fifth title. There's a soccer match. So that seems pretty you young. I don't exactly know when figure skaters genuinely, like, retire, but that seems a little young to me. <sighs> Excuse me. Sorry, we're closed. You can come back tomorrow. Is that you, Yuri? Yeah. <laughs> well, quit standing there like some stranger and tell me how you've been. Fine, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I guess when you live in such a, like, a go small ahead. area, really? you just you don't tend to know everybody. I'm guessing you don't want an audience. Yuko is two years older than me. She was my rink mate. The Madonna of Ice Castle Hatsetsu. <laughs> the Madonna. She's still as pretty as ever. Aww. I mean, that's a great name to have. Great job. <laughs> oh. Move it. You're in my way, fatso. <gasps> Stop. Picking on the new kid doesn't make you look tough, you know. Kids are horrible, I swear. Russia's Victor Nikita. Whoa, that's Victor. He won the gold in the junior worlds with the highest score okay. in history. I did not recognize him with the long hair. So she's like a big reason why he like idolized Victor in such a like a... You know, impactful way. Um, there's something I really want you to see. I 
I've been practicing this ever since the competitions ended. Oh, this is about to be beautiful, isn't it? Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm so ready. Give it to me! <laughs> A quadruple life. Wow. Nice, very clean. Now, I do not know anything about figure skating, so the, the language and, you know, certain phrases, I'm not going to understand at all. Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> this is so... This is great. You can really tell that he loves this. Flying sit spin. Wow. Wow. He's actually doing it. And it seems he's doing it pretty well. This, the music is adding so much to this. It's great. The movement is so fluid. It doesn't look choppy. And there's no use of CGI, at least from what I can see. Why didn't you do that in the finals? I'm sure you would have, you know, went on. <laughs> I gotta say, that was beautiful. That was amazing. amazing. Yeah. That was a perfect <laughs> That was really awesome to see, and it's such a good indication for what we're going to, you know, witness <laughs> from this series. The thing is, my girls actually oh. let them loop. They're a lot bigger than the last time you saw them, aren't they? Who? Yeah. Your girls? As in your children? Or students? Huh, I'm telling you, those three are some of your biggest fans. Oh, God. Hey. You're fatter than me. <laughs> this is... The fat shaming is crazy. <laughs> Come by to practice anytime. The Nishigori family's always got your back. You know that. You can do it, Yuri! Wait a minute. Oh. Not sure how, but I'm going to skate on the same ice as Victor again someday. Okay. We have the motivation. <gasps> You're kidding. I'm really sorry. The girls uploaded it and it's gone viral. What? That's so... Yuri. What a clown. Why doesn't he retire already? Oh my god. I would feel... Oh no, he's watching this. Oh no, this does not bode well at all. Or maybe it does. I don't know. Too big. <laughs> you couldn't be Victor. Uh, Is that his owner's a new guest, some good looking young fellow with an accent. Yes. He's in the spring right now. He you visited okay? him? Hey, where are you going? Uh I would not barge in. This is gonna be awkward. Victor. Why are you here? Oh my god. Wow, okay. Starting today, I'm going to be your new coach. You're going to get to the Grand Prix final, and you're going to win. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh my god, okay. This is great! Not once over the years Absolutely has he ever ceased to surprise me. Okay. That was fantastic. All right, well, that was the very first episode of Yuri on Ice, and I gotta say, that was a fantastic introduction to the series. Uh, the standout moment for me this episode was definitely the actual figure skating scene with Yuri and Victor side by side doing the exact same routine. I, uh, that was so beautiful. And the movement within the animation and the art style was just so fluid and it complemented each other. And I, I think it's just such a good indication to what we're going to see throughout the series and I, I'm i very excited to witness those moments in particular, at least right now. Uh, but the character, Yuri, seems very interesting. He has a deep motivation to get better and to skate on the same ice as his idol, the person that he's been, you know, admiring for so long, Victor. Uh, and I guess he's going to be doing that, except I don't know if he's going to be doing that in like a very competitive way. It seems to me that Victor might be retiring from figure skating, at least competitively, and he's going to be focusing on 
Yuri's training, and probably the other Yuri as well, and they're all gonna become, like, friends. Or maybe rivals. Rivals is probably the correct term. I did not expect the episode to end this way. I, the way that uh, Victor looked, he seemed really upset and annoyed and, you know, angry that Yuri is copying his routine, like, perfectly. But I think what that whole scene was, was Yuri inspiring Victor uh, to train him, I guess. I, I don't know, maybe Victor, you know, saw the talent, saw the potential there. And again, that skating scene was so well done and beautifully executed, and it makes me just so excited to see, you know, what this series has to offer. And so, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, a like, please dislike, or dislike, and tell me what I can do better. Please don't forget to go subscribe, and click that notification bell to go ahead every single time I make a video. And I wish you to see one of you a wonderful day, night, and afternoon, whatever you prefer. And I'll see you all. Bye!